Welcome back to Thanksgiving Blessings with Horse. We've got our last blessing message for the day. And this is Saren, the wise head of my healing herd. She's 23 this year. She's my very first horse. And I treasure her. And when I just asked Miss Saren here what she wants you to remember about Thanksgiving, she just said something very wise indeed. She said, Thanksgiving shouldn't be a day. It should be a practice. It should be something that we invite into our every day. What a shame if we only remember to say thanks once a year for all of our blessings when we could choose. Thank you, Frolic. Frolic wanted to be in this one too, I guess. <laughs> what a sh what a shame to only focus on Thanksgiving once a year when we could choose to do it every single day. Make it a practice of opening our hearts and stepping into gratitude. Anything else you want them to know, Saren? I know. She's just reminding us that some people will have to overcome uh, habits of negativity in order to express their gratitude. Thank you for. <laughs> But uh, overcoming this negativity or these habits, these patterns of thought is a worthwhile pursuit. And the day of Thanksgiving is no better day. There is no better day to start to make a commitment, to make a promise to your heart. Yeah, that's her way of saying yes. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. To make a promise to your heart to find the gratitude in every single moment of every single day. So with that, we send you the healing heart love of horse. Yes, Saren. And wish you all the blessings that are stored in your heart. Happy Thanksgiving.